You must have had yourself a real bash with all those fancy gods and stuff. Could hear all the festivity from all the way out here. How was it, pal? It went better than expected, all in all. I hope you didn't feel left out. It was a pretty limited guest list. Kind of a diplomatic mission, I would say. Not quite as good a time as it might have sounded from the outside. Oh, don't you even worry about me there, pal. I much prefer the solitary life. And besides, when things are good for you, they're good for me. Glad everything worked out. Same here. Aegis. Zeus. instruction boy not for the embodiment of the standard to which you are held set your aim higher than to be like me set your aim higher too Lord Poseidon you know Hefty I had a positively raucous time down there with your old father and Persephone was she at sight I never thought I'd see her again so then we're one big happy family at last well, you've a job to do, and we upon Olympus will do our fair share. I would like none of these. Might of the sea. How'd that happen?
see. Ow. Money. at that feast you threw for all of us down there, but let me tell you, I am under the impression it went smashingly. It was amazing, man. Let's have another one sometime, all right? Definitely not a thing to do. I mean, are we best mates or not? You think on that while I do this. Don't take it personally, Dionysus. Ready. This time, and I am good as grapes. What about these? Cheers, mate.
more. I can take it. this one. Good enough to eat. Hope you enjoyed the feast with the Olympians, Charon. We didn't have much of a chance to chat, though it looked like you and Hermes were having a good time. We'll have to do it again sometime. Hello, Fury sisters. Oh, sorry that you couldn't make the feast back at the house, Desiphony. Though, I don't really think it was your kind of scene. Although Ares was there, he's probably done some murders, right? Murder? Symphony defeated. Got to keep going. Which one? All set. Nowhere to go but up. Courtesy of the pact. Asphodel Meadows. Cheese. 
And by this, it's a flame eater. something of a feast back at your place. A little awkward having to pretend we just met, but hey, I'm an Olympian. Means I can posture with the best of them. Good times, cuz. Glad it all worked out. time during our recent shared festivities, my kin. At last, I've finally seen your death-filled realm firsthand. I learned a great deal. And I look forward to learning more from our successful collaboration, hmm? Say, hon, we like practicing our favorite tune. neck holding up.
targets down. Take it. In the bag. Alicia. about to get a whole lot stronger. Nice and steady. Shall we, sir? Everyone's saying that the Queen is bad. Do you know what that means, short one? Well, for me at least, it happens to mean quite a bit. I'm her son. It doesn't mean a thing. We're still here to fight. Though for what is worth, my mother also was a queen. May yours treat you better than she treated me. 
better than I'm about to treat you here. Caron's going to want all this. Now! A fine catch. Ah. Forgive me, stranger. For, in retrospect, I was too terse after you told me what became of my Achilles. Tales of his climactic battle I had heard. The stuff about his ashes and my own. That was all new. No need to even ask forgiveness, sir. Achilles is one of my closest friends, but he doesn't care to talk about himself. About those times. It must be very painful for the both of you. Oh, we've all seen our share of pain by now. But knowing that he cared for me in the end, after the end, it dulls the feeling of it for a bit, as do these conversations, I guess. Take care, then. If that's your choice, then.
have you yet heard, monster? The Queen Persephone is back to rule the underworld in all her terrifying grace. Perhaps one of these days or nights, she shall be present in the stands to witness your destruction at our hands. Yeah, about that, she's my mother. So maybe watch your fool mouth with me, or else I might just put in a bad word. Oh, you disgust me, demon, that you would even dare to say such things about the Queen. Prepare now to be vanquished in her name. Meg, help. Get away from him. The Fury! This is a scene upon Elysium. <laughs> I guess word travels fast. I'm out of here. Check. Should check this way.
enough of this place. This one, I guess. See what's in here.
Tower of Olympus. Need to keep looking down those passageways. something useful here. Finally found it. Olympus, I accept this message. Who doesn't love this stuff? business. Fang-bearing Cerberus directs all three of his attentions toward the Sator Sack. See you, boy. Kind of nice out here. If you are here, then, the Olympians must still be lending you their aid, just as before. I scarce believe the Queen's preposterous idea worked. That all it took to settle an old score was a blasted family feast. Come on, Father, even you must have enjoyed that feast to some extent. We ought to do it more often. Good thing you trusted Mother's judgment on that one. So then, to the death once more? Indeed. To the death as always, boy. Zagreus, ready yourself.
finished. You asked for this. then, uh, how about a very small, yet very deadly beetle landed upon Hydra slain Zagreus, ending his attempt? Ah! Showed you that time, Father. The feast you had here, it was really something else. All the gods together in one place, eating, drinking, not killing one another. That must have been a sight. You should have been there, Hypnos. Not that I noticed your absence, though what happened? Other pressing business? I slept through the whole thing. Wow. I knew you could do it. So, lad, tell me then, how went the family feast? Was everything all right? Well, I confess I was perhaps a little nervous for practically the entire thing, but all in all, I had a good time. And I'm very, very glad it all turned out the way it did. How about yourself? I quite enjoyed it too. Last time I was invited to a feast, I was still busy warring on the surface. That's how long it's been. I must say, your mother's quite good with words. Had everybody chatting, laughing. She really pulled it off. But for all her confidence, I don't think she knew she had it in her. Because if she did, if she reached out to Olympus sooner, a lot of things could have been different. Don't dwell on that. I spoke a bit with Nix. Your mother had her reasons. No one gets to act on perfect information, right? All we have is what we think we know, and what our conscience tells us. Your mother got to where all this was possible, all thanks to you. All thanks to me, sir. I had ample help along the way. For instance, I could not have done it without you. Would have been using an old chair leg as a weapon, I suppose. And what a fearsome chair leg it would be. In any case, you heading out there soon? Olympus should be more than happy to assist in your security review, if that's what we're calling it now. Yeah, I should go. I'll see you not too long from now. And you, in turn. Resolve the trouble with the satyrs yet. I have to say, Mother, that was a clever plan. Convincing Father to finally let somebody have some fun around here. <laughs> well, I'm glad it worked out for the best. There's just one thing that happened that I ought to tell you about, son. No secrets between us and all. This is quite difficult for me to say. It's about Demeter, isn't it? You two were talking half the night. She wants you to come home with her, doesn't she? You'll always be her little one, something like that. Indeed. 
Something like that. You're quite perceptive, have I ever told you, Zagreus? But yes, my mother, she was quite conflicted. Didn't know whether to smite me or to hold me. Maybe both. And yes, she asked that I come home. To my responsibilities. So, you're leaving? No, Mother, you can't be leaving. You just got here. Oh, it's not as bad as that. It's just... If we are to keep the peace down here, then I must spend some time up there. Every so often. But I shall always return in no time at all. I promised Hades, and I promise you. Well, then, when are you going to go? Soon, Zagreus. Perhaps by the time you're back. I don't suppose I can come with you, can I? You know the surface isn't good for you. Besides, you're needed here. But if you really want to see it for yourself someday, who knows? Perhaps eventually we'll figure out a way. I'm going to miss you, Mother. I'm going to miss you too, son. We're all very proud of you, boy. You were so well behaved at the feast. I was worried sick one uncle or the other was going to set you off at some point, but you were patience incarnate. Thanks for helping show our extended family a good time. How infernal Cerberus, the Hound of Hell, managed to maintain civilized behavior throughout the duration of the recent feast remains a mystery to all who attended. You don't like it when I pet your other heads, huh? No. Back to your senses then, boy. The pact of punishment is not something one ought to trifle with unknowingly, in case you've yet to notice. Father, the pact. You were so blasted strong. I had no idea. All those other times we fought, I can't believe that you were holding back. You were desperate to stop me. You could have. We are bound by the fates to this realm. It is ours, and we belong to it in turn. And... I did not hold back against you. Rather, I had forgotten my old strength. Some of it since returned to me. Must have been all our vicious battles to the death. Or maybe it's from Mother being back in your life? Pointless to even ask. What motivates us is a complicated thing. But if you long to face me with the power I once held during my own youth, you have available to you the means. Bet I can take you. I knew that you were more than capable. It was a privilege to meet your relatives at last, child. Athena, Ares, and the rest. Confronted face to face, they were much more agreeable than I expected. A night we shall remember, was it not? A memorable night it was indeed, Nyx. For most of us, at least. Dionysus, he won't remember any of it, I don't think. But it was really good to see everyone having a good time. Getting along as though they didn't hold a grudge. So then, we're clear, I think. Persephone told them everything they needed to hear. Sometimes that is the only way with family. Though the Olympians... They are prone to their misunderstandings, are they not? This state of kinship may not last eternally. Well, let's enjoy it while it does, I guess. A sound idea. Fish delivery for the head chef. Somewhat a dwelling beast for you, good chef. Pleasure doing do so. This whole place, it looks immaculate. Let's see, even after all, Olympus came here for that giant feast. How did you get everything clean so fast? Oh, <laughs> well, I guess I have my ways, friends. Sometimes you get one of those jobs and you just want to give it everything you've got, you know? I get a lot of jobs like that. Feeding Cerberus, cleaning the rafters, but this one... I just knew it was the perfect job for me. Well, you did amazing here. Wow, Hypnos made the board. Can't get over our gift from the Olympians. It's glorious. 
a majestic gilded edifice of Mount Olympus, crafted with the utmost care from the true mountain stone, now shines forever brightly, even in the dim light of the House of Hades, as a parting gift from the Lord Master's kin. The handiwork of Lord Hephaestus himself. Sounds like he's been rather busy. A little slice of Olympus. Not even tired, thanks. Won't budge. No one around here likes this stuff but me. Not quite there. 